Okay, we know for a fact college is expensive, <laughs> and we're not just talking about the lavish out-of-state schools. A semester at Community College of Denver will run you close to four grand as an in-state student. But there are ways for your kids to earn a degree free while still in high school. One way students are doing that is through what's called concurrent enrollment. Here's Denver 7's Nicole Brady. For a lot of graduating high school students, the college experience will be entirely new. But Ellie Mayer has been there, done that. For a couple years, the first question I ever got was, how old are you? Ellie was 11 when she started courses at Arapahoe Community College. Now at 16, she's graduated from high school and earned an associate's degree. A rarity for sure, but she's one of thousands of Colorado students taking advantage of concurrent enrollment, classes that count for both high school and college. We have 27,000 students who participate a year through our colleges, and 2,000 of them are earning a degree or certificate while they're still in high school. That's 2,000 kids in Colorado who finished two years of college completely free. The school districts pay tuition. It was a no-brainer for Isaiah Curtis. So I'm one of six kids. I'm number four in line. And at this point, we have all either been in concurrent enrollment or currently are in concurrent enrollment. With student loan debt in the U.S. reaching an estimated $1.5 trillion, the concept of free college has caught on with some presidential candidates. But it's a tough sell for many taxpayers, even Isaiah. I do want to work. I do want to work for my degree. I do want to want it. I do want to there to be something that I actually have to put into it. Both Ellie and Isaiah expect they'll have to pay for some of their education. Ellie will continue her studies at CSU this fall. Isaiah plans to pursue a master's degree at CU Boulder. But both say high school students who take even just one college course can get something valuable out of it. The nice thing about college classes, and not to dog on any high school classes that I took, uh, but uh, college classes are really focused on what you need to do. And I feel like the concurrent enrollment really allowed me to hone in on what I needed to do. But if you want that super traditional high school experience all day, it might not be for you. But if you're willing to give it a shot, you can go for it. Nicole Brady, Denver 7. Wow. Well, even with free options available for college, many people are still asking, is college really worth it these days? Now, tonight at 6, we're going 360 on the issue, and you can weigh in with your opinion right now. Send us your comments on the Denver 7 Facebook page or send us an email at 360 at thedenverchannel.com.